In this tutorial, we will guide you on how to create a duct tape effect from scratch in Photoshop. First of all, select the Paint Bucket tool from the menu. Choose E8D4AF for the color and apply it on the canvas. Now go to the Filter menu, select Noise, and click on the Add Noise option. Choose 10% for the amount. Select the Uniform and Monochromatic options and click on the OK button to apply the filter. Add a new layer and change its name to Duct Tape. In this layer, draw a rectangular shape by using the Marquee tool and choose a gray color for the fill. Now go to the Filter menu, select Noise, and click on the Add Noise Filter option. Choose 6% for the amount, leave the rest of the settings as it is, and click on the OK button. Go to the Filter menu, select Texture, and click on the Texturizer filter. Set the scaling to 85%, Relief to 4, and click on the OK button. Go to the Edit menu, select Fade Texturizer, set its opacity to 50%, and click on the OK button. Right click on the duct tape layer and click on the blending options. Go to the bevel and emboss tab, set its depth to 1%, size to 1px, and soften to 1px as well. Now set the angle to 120 degrees, altitude to 30 degrees, highlight modes opacity to 60%, and Shadow Mode's opacity to 30%. Move over to the Texture tab, choose Tiles Smooth for the pattern. Set the scale level to 15%, Depth to 250%. Select both the Link with Layer and Invert options, and finally, click on the OK button to apply the changes made. Use the Lasso tool from the menu and remove both edges of the rectangular shape. Make sure you make an irregular selection to give a more realistic effect. Now, add a new layer, change its name to Wrinkles, set its opacity to 50%, and fill to 0%. Right-click on this layer, select the Blending option from the menu, and click on the Bevel and Emboss tab. Set its depth to 140%, size to 5px, soften to 0px, highlight modes opacity to 100%, shadow modes opacity to 70%, and click on the OK button to apply it. Press the D key on the keyboard to change the foreground color to black. Now create wrinkles on this layer by using the lasso tool. Once you've made a selection, fill it with black color and press the Alt and Backspace key simultaneously on the keyboard. Once you're done with the wrinkle effect, insert your desired text in this layer and change its blending mode to Overlay. Select the duct tape layer, rotate it a bit, and you're done. 